I want to welcome you all back. Thank you so much for the support. Check that description link. Any booking information, anything you need to know about your sis, a date in the life of an amazing Virgo. That behind the scenes look into your situation. <laughs> cross watching, cross listening, everyone is welcome here. Only apply this message how it applies to you. I don't want to see anyone crossed up, but know that the truth will be exposed. That daily conversation, fam. You know what to do. Triple click keeps me in that rotation. Thank you guys so much for that. Hit that like if you have not subscribed. Would love to have you hit that subscribe, that all bell, fam. Leave your tax bracket outside, know what I'm saying? Leave your bad attitude outside. Open your minds and hearts and bring the right elevation in our situation. Let's run it. Welcome back. Crossing you up, tripping you up. Anything that I can find out, any way that I can do that, welcome back. Something new for the fall season, all my fam. Thank you guys for returning. This message. Is for Thursday, September the 5th, double dub four, and Friday, September the 6th, double dub four. Happy Virgo season to all my fans. Being spied on, being lied on. Who is this conniving? This is an angry ass conniving, manipulative person. Now I'm looking at a masculine energy, put it where it needs to go, that's doing something sneaky online and secret. Now this person is trying to remain. Unnoticed. So that tells me that this is a keyboard killer out here. This is online hate. This is a fake profile. This is a bold motherfucker. I'm going to tell you that Virgo, the seven of swords, opening up this message. You guys feel like you have to move strategically. People feel like you're being sneaky nowadays while you guys are in hermit mode. To the hermit, that's the way it needs to be. This screams to me right now. You guys are shut down. You're taking that you time. This is spiritual growth that I'm looking at. Spiritual isolation for your highest good. I'm looking at your finances that are improving, fam. Hold on if you guys are hitting that record button. If you guys have decided, you know, gig work as a second stream of income to put yourselves out here in the public eye. Some of my fam could be doing that and seeing so much success divinely guided. In the darkest hours, you gain sight. This is insight. These are spiritual gifts that have been elevated strong fat. This is that joy that you now understand that that shit does not have to come from fighting for it. That should be natural. So anything that feels bad, anyone that feels like they moving in a certain way, I'm going to pick up on that. And you do. Cancer placements. You guys could be dealing with the cancer, sun, moon, rising. Fam, I'm looking at Aquarius out here, Leo, and you. Virgo all day long. You could be 39 years old. Straw fetch. The nine of pentacles. Let's run it. Heavy Virgo energy could be dealing with the fellow earth sign. When I say joy. This is something that's overwhelming. After going through this. It's like a whole new you. This is a reinvented outlook on life. And now someone is in regret. That they did not treat you better. They're in regret that you saw this part of them. But baby, you can't hide who you really are. See, that's the problem. You know, those authorized representatives we all have when we first meet people, that's just having your manners, right? But it's too hard to be fake. Either you're going to be on the up and up, or that demonic, nasty ass spirit is going to come out of you. Somebody did something to you, and there's no going back from that. This person was rude. This person used you. For some of you all, this person literally stole from you. Open it up with the seven of swords. But uh, say what? Say huh? They're receipts that you have. So whatever this person is watching you do online, it's like they're trying to cover shit up. I'm trying to burn any evidence. Now that's where they messed up at. That's a very stupid thinking individual. Because what are they going to do Virgo right? Come back and get yours. Fam there's something that you know. You guys can have pictures of something. Receipts of something. Bank statements. And you do not mind pulling a person's whole card. With this high priestess energy. Heavy Pisces energy. You guys are keeping something close to the best. You guys know I can't let on. I can't let you pick up. In a smile, none of my emotion, none of that. You guys have that in check. The five of cups, Scorpio energy. Whoever this is feels slighted. 
They feel away. I'm telling you, they're in their feels over you being happy. Now, whatever this regret is about, you could be 48 years old, September the 12th. I see you out here, August the 25th in the building. You guys can have a five-year-old. Has something to do with something they tried to cover up. There's so many secrets that are out here. The moon caught. Things are being exposed about a plot, a plan, something that a person did to steal from you. This person is sneaking around you right now. They aren't physically around you looking at this high priestess. But you can sense it. You can sense the drama. This is projection. People are projecting that energy nowadays. You know that Virgo. You guys are mirroring one another. I'm going to let you know masculine or feminine. It's like you gave them back to themselves. And fam, I have to take a look at what it is that I did. But still, there is no ownership. I do not like the smug, nasty grin that this person has. You know, this is the type of motherfucker. Nah, I got your ass now. You know exactly what I'm talking about, fam, to experience that, right? And the way this person made you feel like just in regret forever opening up to them in the first place with this Nine of Pentacles to this Five of Cups. That's what I'm getting from her. I had this on my own. I have this on my own. So what's not for me? Cry two tears and I'm walking. Fuck it. Baby, the chariot card. You guys could be seen. Seven, one, seven, seven, three, seven. His soul message is here for you. Seven, seven, seven. The hangman. The chariot card. The seven of swords. Pisces energy. Heavy cancer Pisces. Scorpio energy. Baby, this is you being afforded again that opportunity, Virgo, to fall back. The enlightenment that you have with the hangman and the high priestess being out here gave sight in darkness, fam. It's something that you said to someone. It's a way that you're moving now. A person feels like this energy is off. A person's afraid that you're getting ready to tell on them. There's someone that's afraid that you have receipts that can get them locked up because you're not showing your full hand. While with this high priestess being out here, let's run it. Not once, but twice. Fam, I got that supernatural deck. That Virgo-ish. I had to go and get that deck. I got that deck on hand. Haven't used it in a while. Got some channel messages, baby. And we are going in. The Five of Swords. Seven, seven, seven. Numbers starting and ending with seven. Five, five, five. Fifty-five could be significant. You could be turning fifty-five this Virgo season. First, middle, last initial. J, W, R. This could be someone nicknamed Junior. You could have a child with this individual. Damn, this is an attitude person. This is secret jealousy. This is secret competition. And this is me in secret doing underhanded things, sneaky little things, conniving little things. Because right now, fam, you guys are in this abundant energy. This moon card. You know moon is also an omen. That predicts fortune. And you know that. That five of cups baby. Right now your ex whoever this is. All of their secrets are being exposed. And this person doesn't know what to do. It's like they're stuck between a rock. And a hard spot fam. The eight of cups on its forehead spinning. You better know this. Not walking away. I'm not letting this go. I have an axe to grind. Wow. I'm not moving on. I'm holding on to a bullshit secret so that I can sabotage you later. 888. Eight, eight. You guys getting these synchronicities right, Virgo? The Eight of Wands? Things that are happening quick and fast for you, but I feel like right now someone is trying to just get a handle on what you got going on. With this high priestess being out here not once but twice, this could be a spiritualist out here that is in your energy, baby. That is doing the ultimate no-no. Okay, this is the ultimate violation. Trying to tap into your Akashic records. The Eight of Wands, baby. She can't stop wants. That turnaround is here. Some of my fam could feel like things have been moving stagnant with this hangman energy. Right? But again, for your protection. Baby, rejection is protection. You're being protected from someone who's trying to have you stuck. Your angels are out here strong, fam. The Eight of Wands are. We're going to go ahead and keep the party going. The Eight of Wands, fam. I am looking at Leroy Brown. That's communication. That's someone that wants to hit you up. Hey, trust me. What I lied to you is cleared up by the Seven of Wands for sure. Could be seen 777. Seven, seven, seven. I think not. <laughs> That's that protection from yourself. 
These are dreams that you're having, baby. Premonitions, visions that you guys get. You could just be sitting in your recliner just kind of gnawing off. Wow, what the fuck was that about? That was awkward. 9-11, as I'm saying that September the 11th, Virgos, I see you guys eye here. Wow. It's like in your dreams. The premonitions that you have, the downloads that you get, baby, that's the roadmap. It shows you, hey, go this way. Go that way. This shit is strategic, divine, feminine, divine, masculine. The Nine of Swords is someone that's stressed out. I don't like this. Someone's trying to get you out of character. Someone's trying to get you caught up. And baby, it's all energy. If I pick up on the energy, I'm letting it fly with this Virgo energy being out here. You guys could be dealing with the fellow Virgo fat, right? Who is on some bullshit. The king of pentacles on its forehead. Spitting to the king of blades. This is somebody out here that is, you know, making money in an illegal way. Right? So, fam, be careful with that. There are people that are checking you out. People that are lying and saying that, baby, okay, some of you guys into pharmaceutical sales, that's that fast money. That's that quick money. You guys could be dealing with somebody that's all about that. For the streets. I'm looking at a blue vehicle. To the ace of pentacles. Fat. That chariot car. These could be new homes. New vehicles for sure. My family is leasing. Some of you guys could be getting property. Commercial property. Vehicles. In your company name. I'm seeing that as well out here. With this good fortune. But this is someone that's trying to remain anonymous. This person is busy around you. If this individual knows where you live, Virgo, if this person knows how to find you, if this person knows where you work, if this person knows anything about what you are doing online, I'm trying to ruin that. I'm trying to cozy up to whoever has that bag and get them into some legal trouble. Somebody feels like you will be stupid for them. This is out of control. Like I said, you completely lost interest. The Ace of Swords, everything you hearing up in here, you know, baby, ain't nothing but straight gangster truth. The King of Pentacles on its forehead spinning with the King of Blades out here. This person means business. Now, this could be a same-sex dynamic. This could be a person that likes to take advantage of people, baby, and pretty much milk them, okay? Juice them until they have nothing left. This is someone that could have left some of my fam in a real tight situation. Wow. I'm looking at plagiarism as well. You know, it's been showing up. People trying to take credit for work. That is not theirs. That's out here as well. This Ace of Swords, you could be 37 years old, breaks down to a 10. This cycle is over. That burden has been dropped. But that's telling me this person is on some betrayal type shit. The Swords, for sure legal issues. You guys could be getting communication, fam. With this Eight of Wands being out here and the Ace of Swords. From a man, woman in uniform, you know, could be the police, somebody like that. This is an investigator. This could be a detective that may show up based on some bullshit. You know, checking on family situations with this king of pentacles on its forehead spitting next to this king of blades. This is someone that's lying and saying that some of you guys are unfit parents. Wow. With the swords, baby, everybody knows straight up this warns you. Against an assault. That shit can happen sooner or later. That just depends on the distance that you have between you and this person. This could be threatening energy. Major projection. Because whoever this is has low self-esteem. You are nothing but encouragement. Look at, at this nine of pentacles. These people trying to come against one individual. This is a takedown. This is one, two, three individuals. Again. This for sure could be a same-sex dynamic. That could be something that's coming out about this individual. All secrets are coming out intuitively. If you've ever felt that, know this. I'm looking at the name Olivia. The name Emma is I here. This is secret jealousy. This is secret competition. And whoever this masculine is, fam, that wants you to trust them one more time is getting ready to make a stupid play. Try to play on your talk. Try to play on your emotions. This high priestess tells me that this is somebody that could be going to get a read done. You know, let me know what's going on in my energy. But because they're playing around in your energy, wanting to know also what's going on with you. Hey, can you check into this? Can you check into that? The number eight is out here strong. That is the number of karma. You already know, babe. As above, so below. 
This is the laws of karma that are working right now in your favor. Now this person is trying so hard to gain your trust. Just so that I could break up with you. And when I break up with you, I want to make sure that you pretty much break up with you as well. This person is out to destroy. Now when I see this three of swords, fam, heavy Aquarius energy. You could be dealing with an air sign, a Libra, a Gemini. 39 years old. I believe we had 37, 38, 39, if I'm not mistaken. Like I said, everything is happening in synchronous form. 39, 39 is I here twice. That's what it was, fam. 37 and 39. 39, 39, angel number. Wow. That breaks down to a 12. September the 12th, Virgos. You guys been seeing 12, 12? Look up, it's 12, 12. Definitely messages here for you. Master number 33. Life path number 2. Life path number 3. Could have messages here. This is deception. This person wants to lie to you. I'm going to break your trust. I'm going to break your heart. Who was this cheater that you lost interest in? The two of swords, this is someone that's trying to put blockages in your way. The two of swords, not only did you lose interest, fam. Hey, fam, I lost all contact. You deleted this person's information. You deleted this person from your energy. Some of you guys, if I could just try and forget this motherfucker, I would. While well, I had a card hit the floor, let's see what this is for all my verb. Clear it up the three of swords. You better know. You better know it. The ace of pentacles. Again, Virgo Taurus kept record to the Knight of Wands. This is stick and move, stick and move. This is someone that likes to be paid for companionship. You know what I'm saying? This is somebody that wants to gain your trust. And I may not hit you up right away for a loan, but I will go on to do that. I just got to make sure I marinate that fish. Oh my goodness, fish. Wow, who's pregnant out this? But you guys could be dreaming about fish draw fat. You may find out that this person has children with another person. Hide their secret pregnancy. But this Ace of Pentacles tells me one thing. Confirmation, Virgos. You guys are in such abundant energy. Like I said, baby, this is an omen of fortune. But this is nothing but greatness. This is you showing up for you. I believe in me. Six of Wands. Woo! Virgos, this is beautiful. I mean, truly... It, for the past week or so, one of the best messages, one of the best readings I have done for my family, that changes here. You guys are serious about these shifts in your life. You guys are serious about being better people. That glow up is here. You guys are confronting fear out here, strong Virgo. Making the right choices with the two of wands. I know that's right. This is about wellness inside and out. While with this night of wands, I hear this is about fitness as well. You guys are energized right now. Make sure you're taking the time to nourish yourselves, right? Pamper yourselves. But fam, what this is telling me with this night of wands, this Leo energy, I'm not taking these motherfuckers too seriously. Pineapple, please. That hermit card, you guys are busy at home. Some of you guys could be working from home. Side hustles look amazing. You know, staying home, just home bodies, just doing you. The Hierophant to the Three of Wands, fam. What if I told you, right? You know, and we all have that freedom of choice, free will. With that Two of Swords being out here, okay? Those are about decisions. What to keep, what to throw away. That Two of Wands being out here, that Aries energy. It's about you making the right choices. For the Hierophant to be out here with the Three of Wands, this is a commitment. But what this is also telling me is somebody wants closure and the closure that I want is to get you locked up the Hierophant commitments definitely the Hierophant chosen Starcy favor over your life oh he loves you like that he took his time when he made this world but you are his world and you know this but this Hierophant to the three of wands is telling me that someone with all of his bullshit being out here is trying to get you set up like I said I'm gonna get you tripped up one way or another. If I can come in and out of your life, this will work and have you in some sort of legal problems. That's jail. But as above, so below. So the closure that this person is looking for, fam. I mean, seek ye first the kingdom of God, right? In all of his righteousness, everything will be added onto you. This person is too stupid to obtain knowledge. No wonder they in a knight of wands energy. Very immature. 
very all over the place. This person is stress driven. And baby, you better watch yourself, baby. Because this is nothing but trouble ahead. Whoa, the empress to him downstairs. Any questions? Obsessed with you. Oh, you belong to me forever. This is ownership. This is possession over your energy. This is an insecure person. Again, I'm looking at a masculine. Put it where it needs to go. You know, gender's non-specific. And tarot for all Virgos. But whoever this is, is more than addicted to you. Wow. Trying to move on is what I get from this. With that eight of cups being in reverse, this person really is. But they can't. So I sent some shit out. That's that love magic. That's that come to me spells, all that shit. All it does is drive you further away. And when you put things out there like that, right, it has to go back to whoever dealt that shit. This is sending repeated evil eye. This person de doesn't even understand their obsession with you, Virgo. So somebody damn sure has tried to play with some shit out here. Wow. You guys got the eye. I mean, opening up this message. Everybody's so concerned about how you're doing your thing, Virgo. But don't nobody pay no bills. And nobody was there, okay? When you were shooting in the gym. When you was practicing, okay? When you was sitting out here trying to perfect your shit. Nobody was there when you could have used that help. Nobody was there to give you an encouraging word. But motherfuckers were damn sure there to bring you burden. The Ten of Wands. Whoa. Clearing up this Three of Swords. Whoever this is, fam. I'm looking now at the Queen of Swords on her forehead spinning. Now this could have for sure been someone that you were married to. I'm looking at Kerry Washington. Okay, that could be a name, Kerry. The last name Washington. You guys can live in Washington State for my strong Virgo fam. In a state of short disbelief. Now Carrie, she is a, a Capricorn Aquarius cusper. I believe she is an Aquarius right there on that Capricorn cusp. But him downstairs being out here, what I'm looking at is bars. Wow, supernatural. Thing. This devil energy, this is definite projection. This devil energy is somebody that is Pissed off the Ten of Cups, like I said, a state of shock. You know, the Ten of Cups, that's abundance, definitely. But baby, that's happiness, that's guaranteed. You know, that's enough. Flag on the play with the divine being at him. Do not normalize disrespect. You're not your circumstances. It doesn't matter what you've been through. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to make sure that those kids, Always go to bed with their bellies full and a smile on their face. That ten of cups, you guys are reliable. That ten of cups, a person walks in your home and it just feels so cozy, so warm. With that empress out here, nurturing. You always smell delicious food cooking, you know what I'm saying? There's always a kind word. I'm always going to greet you and treat you with respect, right? So yeah, this person is jealous. Who's getting that now? That three of swords could tell me that this person's bubble has been popped. Okay, ego is out of control. I want to know who's loving on my shit now. This person really feels like they own you. Wow, 22, 22 on the clock as I'm saying that. With the eyeball being out here, you guys could be 49 years old. Breaks down to a 13, the four of swords. Four, four, four. Divine protection in every which way of the word, guys. I'm looking at a picture of Nicki Minaj. Heavy Sagittarius energy. Nicki Minaj. Minaj situation. Nicki Minaj. I'm always needing validation from outside sources. This was definitely a whole cheat. But impulsive as they are with him downstairs, I'm saying it straight up, fam. Protect yourselves, I hit. Because not only is this person by curious, okay, looks like they're addicted to sex and when you have no control over shit, okay, and that shit is running you with him downstairs and the Knight of Wands that could be a sexually transmitted disease. This person does not care about wrapping it up, but I'm telling you, fam, somebody right now, I'm not particular about who I'm you know, attracted to what is that pansexual? I'm not exactly sure what that is, fam. Educate your sis. Put that in the comments. Let me know. But that's what that trap is. This is an internal battle that this individual is having. And it's like whoever they dealt with, you know, of the same sex that they were trying to hide. 
You know, this could be a whole relationship that they're in with the karmic situation. Another person, whoever their man is, you know what I'm saying? My boy, my girl, whoever this is that they're always with. Somebody has put two and two together. Whoever that they're sleeping with of the same sex has enjoyed that shit a little bit too much, strong Virgos. I'm going to let you know. Because whoever this is, right, is getting ready to let that shit all hang out. We go together like that. Oh, your person got a lot of shit going on. And looking at Nicki Minaj, the three of swords. The reason why this person's blocked in the four of swords, why you guys are so pulled back, strong fam, okay? Definitely getting that rest. Like I said, intuition is on. Bitch, come find me and some more shit. But that's because of these sexual fetishes. This is, wow. You know, I hate to see people this confused. And it's, this, it's, the, it's not that this motherfucker's confused, Virgo. It's like, I'm afraid of a person accepting me for who I am. You know, if I come out of my mouth and say that I struggle with my sexuality, it makes it real for me. This motherfucker lives in a constant state of confusion and lies. So that's how they like to do other people. No control. I'm in same sex chat rooms and shit trying to hide that shit. Nicki Minaj, you discovered, right? For some of you guys could have been married. I'm the side wife, the side motherfucking husband, right? That's been coming out in this situation. Oh, hell no. If, if you're that on the fence with this two of swords and this two of wands out here and making a decision. I see you, Virgo. Hey, fam. Respectful. I love you enough, baby, to set you free. Choose that. I know that's right. I don't want you to teeter-totter with your life or what decision to make when it comes to me. I got me, me. Channel messages. Or Virgos. Know this. Now, whatever you guys are doing as far as gig work, that's a goal. Baby, get busy with that, fam. You know, any second stream of income that you guys are into, any side hustles, everything looks amazing with that Ace of Pentacles. Channeled messages. Let's run it. On some hot and heavy shit. It says here, charged up. Adrenaline rush. Wow, this person has a very Hefty sexual appetite. And that's for whatever that I'm attracted to. It's all good. But you can't put other people in situations like that. As careless as this individual is, that's where people get hurt. That's where people get sick, right, Virgo? Ain't gonna be none of that shit. I know that's right. Well, how about these flying monkeys? Wow. Dealing with somebody narcissistic, I see. I have people that are running and reporting back to me. I have other people that monitor you online as well. Thank you, haters, fam. Thank you, haters. You know, message says a history of many short-term relationships, air quotes. Wow. And I'm looking at Virgo. It says, Virgo, you guys for sure could be dealing with the fellow Virgo. Wow. Final message. Wow. Pop up after all this time. For real, for real? Uh-huh. For real, for real. Know this. Says, I miss your energy. A knock at your door. Unexpected visitor, text, call. This is also unwanted contact out here. The Page of Swords fan, opening up this message. Like I said, someone's stalking you and someone is mad at what they see. So it makes no sense for a person to sit there and keep torturing themselves. Well, Virgo, this person is trying to bring you guys some sort of an illness as well. Virgo, I'm looking at a person right now. That could have something wrong with them, okay? That could be terminal. Now, fam, energy does not lie. Somebody's going some motherfucking way. The Eight of Cups. To the death. To the Queen of Bones. Okay? Now, the Eight of Cups, that's okay. I've done enough. I love you, but I got to go again. Free, free. Set them free. You guys could be listening to Sting. Wow, fam. But this Eight of Cups supernatural day. Okay, with love, I gotta go. Something made you pull yourself out and not go back. You're not in the same place. It's something that this person did, fam. You can't fake with me no more. But with this Eight of Cups being out, it's like you have to move now with an energy where you gotta constantly look over your shoulder. Make sure you got something with you. Pepper spray or something. Protect yourself. This Eight of Cups, whoever you walked away from, Pisces energy to the death got a sword out. Cups, that's loving energy. What the fuck does a sword, right, have to do with love to the death? The Queen of Bones. 
welfare. Now tell me this is not a dog spiritualist because it sure is. This is little death magic out this bitch. Somebody has sat around, you don't have to be holding hands, you know, and chanting and all that shit. And spoke of you in that way. Somebody is trying to manipulate energy as well at his strong fam. It's like destiny swapping, but that shit ain't going to work. Cleared up by the will of, you ain't heard no studio audience, Virgo. The Ace of Pentacles, this is real life shit. Somebody is really dealing with some real life sickness. This could be a spiritually transmitted disease as well. I am looking at an individual who looks very red by the eyes. Now, fam, I got my illustration deck out right now. And I'm clearing up this will of fortune. And what popped out, as I'm said, this is someone for sure that is sick. I'm looking at a masculine energy. Maybe they don't know where they contracted this from. Okay? Now, for some of you all, just side note, this could be allergies. This could be hay fever. Itchy, itchy eyes, you know what I'm saying? The nose. I'm looking at a person's face. They're really swollen right around the eyes and the nose. This could be sinus infections as well. But, baby, this is someone right now that is having one heck of a pity party with that five of cups coming out here. Right? And when I say confusion, this says mental illness, health, sickness, STD, sexually transmitted disease, spiritually transmitted disease, STI. That means someone's tried to tap into your fucking energy, fam, blocked, and has gotten sick. When you want to be another person so bad, you are asking for everything that that individual had to go through. The will of fortune. This ain't no joke. You don't have to pay no taxes on this, right, Virgo? This is godly given. This is your destiny. This is your birthright. So whatever you guys had to deal with in your life, it's like now this person, they get to deal with their shit and that as well. On top of that, the shit that I did to you. I really feel like for some of you guys, this person ran off with money. Some of you guys, as a person that's trying to make money off of you. Wow. It's like when they look at you, they see dollar signs. But the one thing I do not have is a willing participant. Wow. Too much for me, strong Virgo. There are plants around you. Now, I'm looking at the Knight of Cups to the Magician called Wow. Now, guys, you know, they could tell me that my, my fab right now could just be enjoying yourself, you know, having a couple of beers, having a glass of wine. This is powerful manifestation energy. Falling in love with you again is what this is saying. Taking your time with yourself, damn sure, pampering yourself, not playing with a motherfucker straight up. And if I know... I can see it in my mind's eye. I know that I can have it. That's what this is saying with this magician call. But this is a person that could like to drink a little bit too much. Okay, with this chariot card being out here, this could be for sure a DUI. With this chariot card being out here, somebody could get pulled over, have some warrants, and go straight to jail. This is someone that's trolling some of you guys. Some of you family, you guys are being followed by this motherfucking person. To the nine of swords, yes, yeah, somebody is not okay. Whoa. I am so focused on trying to destroy any possibilities for you moving forward. That I'm not focusing on myself. And the reason why things are happening this way for me in my life. While it's sad when a person seems to be immune to karma, okay? Bad fucking juju. Wow, it's like they have a generational curse that's over them. Okay, cursed. Know this. Know this. Will of Fortune energy. I'm looking at a total snake at his strong fat. That is under judgment for something foolish that they tried on a whim to this justice court. And they're worried about it. Someone is hurt. I fell off my tricycle. Ain't got nobody to put a band-aid on the boo-boo looking ass. Who is this overgrown ass person? Because baby, they are mad. These are outbursts. Nobody around them can stand them right now. Virgo, this is an illustration, okay? This is energy. This is some shit that you guys have already healed from. But damn, I don't like this motherfucker. Damn. This type of person you just look at, just frown up at, just snur your nose up at shit. Shake your head, walk the fuck away. You old stupid bitch. This person, I mean, that's what I get from this. Why watch a person if it makes you feel like that? I don't understand this motherfucker, but that's that magic. 
that's backfired. They don't understand it either. It's like, I don't know how to get out of this. Virgo will be the only way. And you know this. The sun card clearing up that justice. Yeah, I will be. But baby, right now, I'm all about me. You guys could be with child. You could be expecting baby strong Virgos. You guys could have little Leo children. I'm looking at the sun card so happy. But that sword is out. Wow, heavy Aquarius energy. It's like you're smiling a motherfucker, okay? With love, you look at him with a smile wholeheartedly. Oh, no, I'm not going to be able to do that. And I'm going to let you know right now, if you ever try that shit, bitch, okay? You might have to look for your head because I might snatch your head off. They might have to plant a seed and you may have to grow a whole nother head. You don't play that shit about your work. You guys are on top of that. Oh, yeah. It's like you watching motherfuckers watch you with this sun caught eye here, Virgo. I don't care what you do. The sun is always going to shine in my life. Let's go, motherfucking Virgos, with this justice card I hear. The three of cups to the six of cups. But can we please just, what's your drink, Virgo? I mean, I want to make it better. Can I fix you this dinner? Can anything just, wow. Oh, that's not going to work. I'm back to being mad again. Watch any invitation. A person wants to have you inebriated. A person wants to slip something in your drink. This is food magic. Any way that I can fit, fit in your life and knock you off this motherfucking pedestal. These secret accounts. There are people that watch you. That like what you do. But rather than compliment you. You guys been seeing any, you know, fucked up comments pop up. Anything like that. For sure is this past person busy. But these are people that are showing up and showing you. Your haters are letting you know who they are looking at this Virgo. They want to celebrate with you. But these are things that you're long over, over with. You know, this is overdue for you. This victory, this success that you're having. This confidence that you carry. That right there has put motherfuckers in their place. The things that you see, again, this justice card I hear fam. The supernatural deck. I'm looking at them people. Them boys. And this corp. This is a female corp. She is holding. Okay. A scale. The scales will be balanced. You guys could be in law enforcement. You could be ex-military. You guys could be in the military. You could wear uniforms to work. Nurses. Nursing assistants. Medical assistants. You guys could be correctional officers. Wow. Fam. This is security. But like I said. Some of you all. It's something that you have. You have evidence. And it's like some of you guys may be getting a visit from a detective, from a law enforcement official, fam. And this motherfucker's, oh, okay. Well, we just had to check into. Somebody is trying to get you hemmed up, I hear. So even though you've erased the contact information for this bitch, you may have this person blocked. If there's something that you know for sure, for sure, this person did, fam, keep all receipts. CYA. Who is doing what? Get excited about that thing. That Ace of Pentacles energy. That Five of Cups. I'm lonely. Have an outburst. This person is awfully immature and just warning for some of you guys. Him downstairs. Bars around this person. I mean mentally this person is caged. You know physically they're stuck in a karmic situation. Physically they're stuck with some sort of an illness that they're trying to hide. They're stuck with all of these lies that are coming out. There's no way that I can over talk that shit. It is what it is. People know. And also I'm seeing that people understand now that shit's not adding up. The inadequate shit that this person said. The way that they tried to portray you. Hey none of that shit real. People are discovering that. Because it's now. This person is kind of just sitting off to themselves. Worried about going to jail. Worried about trapping you. Worried about harming you. Wow. Put this where it needs to go for all family. Any signs that you hear, baby, those signs could have messages here. Any messages that come out, confirmations for sure could be significant. Let's run it for all Virgos. I'm looking at Scorpio. It says Scorpio placements. That could be your sun, moon, rising, someone that you know. Blue trunk. Wow. Blue car, blue SUV. The name blue could be significant as well. Blue is out here. I'm looking at Virgo. For sure, you guys could be dealing with the fellow Virgo. Virgos all over the world. I see you to the sun court. What this is saying to me is Virgos are in hermit mode. Virgos are 
could be a true to themselves, that Nine of Pentacles energy, that Empress energy. This is saying that Virgos could be single mothers, single fathers, and happy, abundant, and fam. Right behind that confirmation. Haven't seen this card in a minute. You will be known nationwide for your gifts, your talents. The answer is yes. Explanation point. Wow. Celebrity status, it says go, go, go. Wow. Energy does not lie. Black magic. Root work. Wow. For all my Virgos, unlock it. You could be 38 years old. Ah, you have an aha moment. That's six of cups. Reflection. Shit's coming back to you. Things a person said to you. The way they moved around you. Certain things now. Uh huh. Now you're away from this person. Now you can handle that because you've healed from it. And also, I couldn't let you know about this when you were around this person. You know what I'm saying, Virgo? Because you would have reacted. This is a blossom bless, uh, blessing <laughs> blocker. Let's go. Wow, say that shit three times fast. Right behind that, you guys could be dealing with the Taurus. I'm looking at May Taurus. That could be your name. May is I hear something that could have happened in May. Or Earth signs could resonate with this. Set. Capricorn is back. I hear. Know this. Unexpected pop up. Virgos. Wow. This person wants to catch you off guard. I'm so glad that you guys were got it here. I said it. Again, the month of May is I here. Strong Taurus energy. You could have a Taurus child as well. This could be a Taurus that you guys are here for. First, middle, last, initial M. G. S. A. Y. Something could have came out in the month of May. Somebody could be gay for pay. Worried about what a motherfucker's going to say. The 5th is I here. The 10th. The 18th is I here. That number 0. You guys been seeing 0, 0, 0. Look up, it's 1 o'clock. Look up, it's 10 o'clock. 8 o'clock. Messages here for you. That's that full card energy. Aquarius. Aries energy. Clean slate. Fresh start. Starting over. I know that's right. Putting down some solid roots, solid foundation, solid Virgos, Pisces. Again, Capricorn or an air sign. Could be significant Gemini, Aquarius or Libra. Message. Wow. Stress. Try to cause mental problems for you. Purposely. Uses people. And then avoids mind games. Know this. First, middle, last initial C. M. W. Z. B. Or all could be significant. This message right here, oh my goodness, is for somebody had sex the last time you saw them again. Aha! Motherfucker, it says. Aha moment. Wow, for my fam. Uh, right behind that, that last sexual encounter. Whoa, fam. I ain't gonna touch that. Woo. Yes. Gemini. Libra. Or an Aquarius again could be significant. Final message. This is about your intuition. It says here conclusions, knowledge. It's all good. Understanding. I get it. Wow. I hope this message helps. Well, fam. I know, right? Okay. The list that people go to to try to harm another person. And they just end up harming themselves and it's just so much worse. I love you all. Triple click, like, subscribe, or bell. And enjoy your weekend. I will tap in with you guys on Saturday for that earth sign message. <laughs> Lady Gator.